the function of a Zen teacher is to put his students in all kinds of situations where in the normal course of social relations they would get stuck. By asking nonsensical questions, by making absurd remarks, and above all, keeping them stirred up with impossible demands. To stop the sound of a train whistle in the distance, magic. To touch the ceiling without getting up from one's chair. To hear the sound of one hand. All these impossible questions are asked. In the ordinary way of interpreting these questions, we think, well, now we, how could we do that? The language game that we play, and the social games, the production games, and the survival games that we play, are good games. But we take them so seriously, that we think that that is the only important thing. Is a lightning flash bad because it lives for a second? As compared with the sun that goes on for billions of years? To without moving, stop a ship sailing out on the water and you have to think what would I do to do that so you see we spend an awful lot of energy trying to make our lives fit images of what life is or should be which they could never possibly fit 